everyone welcome back to aura permata let's study here today we are crafting something truly special that is our bali brew cafe latte soap bar this is our finished bar oh, so yummy it smells amazing it's just like your favorite latte okay this soap bar is packed with a natural ingredient for your skin and it's made with uh, nourishing oil like olive oil, coconut oil, castor oil, sweet almond oil. Plus there is also include uh, shea butter and cacao butter. It's for luxurious softness experience for your skin. And before we dive in into soap making process, remember cleanliness and safety is our top priorities. So always put on your personal equipment like goggle, glove, well, face mask, hair cap, and always wear long sleeve, long pants, and shoes to protect your skin from any splashes. And always sanitize all your equipment and tools before starting weighting all your ingredients because we work with raw material. Remember, cleanliness is our top priorities. Don't wait any longer. We will start now to make our Bali Brew Cafe Latte so far. Before that, please uh, like these uh, videos and subscribe our YouTube channel in Aura Permata, Bali. Also, you can visit our website here if you want to snack a bar for yourself. We are starting to make our magic soap. So first of all, we will wait our ingredient. I always follow the recipes to make our products. First of all, we need coconut oil for 510 gram. This is our coconut oil. And now we will add our sweet almond oil for 30 gram. And here is our sweet almond oil. And we will add our castor oil. We need 50 gram on this recipe. And then we will add our nourishing oil that is olive oil. We need 350 gram of olive oil. My olive oil I infuse with calendula flour. And next we will add our shea butter and cacao butter. We have our cacao butter. We need 30 gram of cacao butter. I make small chunks because we need to melt the butter in the microwave after. Or if you prefer to melt in the double boiler or so, it's good. Tear it. And here I have my shea butter. We also need 30 gram for the shea butter. Butter is so creamy. I love this butter. 30 gram of shea butter. And now we will pop the oil to melt all the butter in the microwave. While we are waiting for the oil to melt and Let's wait our coffee light solution because we are using coffee now. So the coffee water, like I make ice, I put it in the freeze to help it to cool down faster when we make the light solution. We need uh, 306 gram our lye, and this is our lye. Need 150 gram of lye. Okay, we give a little stir to our oil. So, for the lye solution, when you make this lye, always add the lye into the water. Not the way around, pouring the water into the lye. It can create a violent reaction, like making volcano. So that is dangerous. We will make now our uh, 
coffee light solution and always work with a ventilated uh, open area like open window if you are working in the room put on your ex exhaust fan if you have it or work outside there where is open open area like here i have my window open and always put on your goggles your gloves for your own safety reason we keep aside now we will make our color we add activate charcoal powder to give a little bit darker color for our coffee because when you mix the coffee water light solution into the oil because later they will create soap base. The color will turn a little bit uh, lighter. So now we add our special product that is active chakra powder. It's a little bit. And also this chakra powder is very good for your skin. It's good for detoxifying. And we will add a little oil. We have our color. And now we will make our white color and I'm using titanium dioxide. And the titanium dioxide, we dilute with uh, still water. This is my titanium dioxide. So we have our warm distilled water. And then we will blend our vanilla and coffee essential oil. This is our essential oil. We need 10 gram of vanilla essential oil and 10 gram of coffee essential oil. It smells so good. The room is filling with amazing, yummy aromas. Keep aside. And now we will check our oil temperature in the lye. It's 121. And the lye, it's 104 Fahrenheit. It's good to add our active ingredient now. So here is our secret ingredient that I will add on our soap bar. We have Colin clay and coconut milk powder. Plus there is also oat milk powder. So we will add our Colin clay first. We need a spoon of Colin clay. We will add our coconut milk powder and we will add our oat milk powder. And the last but not least, we will add our sodium lactate. This is to help your soap bar um, lasting. We need a tablespoon of sodium lactate. We add into our coffee light solution, okay? And then we need thick blender. The temperature is good. I will give a little stir on the oil. And now you have to watch this. We will create a magic soap. It looks like coffee. So, okay. Now we will divide. We will add our blend essential oil. A little bit here and the rest here. We have our first layer because I like to design my soap. We give a little bit top. This is to avoid bubbles. And now we will make our second layer. Wow. The soap butter is very fast. We add a little bit our titanium dioxide. We pour a little bit more. Our second layer. Now we will make our third layer. Now we add the last titanium dioxide. That's it. This is our Bali Brew Cafe Latte Soap. Is it right to make it beautiful? Smell amazing. And this one, we need to cure uh, for 24 hours first to unmold it and cut slices into bar. And then cure for four weeks and ready to use it. Beautiful, right? Nice so. Hmm. Okay, and that's it for today. Thank you very much uh, to stay with uh, us for this journey. And hope you like this video and spread this video with all your friends. And don't forget if you like to grab ones 
for yourself and just visit our website at auraparmatabali.com and or directly to our WhatsApp catalog here. Bye for now.